Samuel L. Jackson is an American actor, producer, singer, and voice actor. He's widely regarded as one of the most popular actors of his generation. Samuel L. Jackson is a highly prolific actor, having appeared in over 150 films. The films in which he's appeared have collectively grossed over $27 billion worldwide, making him the highest-grossing actor of all time. This is when cameo appearances are excluded. He rose to fame with films such as Coming to America in 1988, Goodfellas in 1990, Juice in 1992, Menace to Society in 1993, Jurassic Park in 1993, and Fresh in 1994. Samuel L. Jackson has an estimated net worth of $248 million. Samuel L. Jackson's Early Life Samuel Leroy Jackson was born on the 21st of December in 1948 in Washington, D.C. He's the only child of Elizabeth Harriet Montgomery, who was born in 1923 and died in 2012, and Roy Henry Jackson, who was born in 1929 and died in 1988. His mother, Elizabeth Harriet Montgomery, was an actress known for biography film in 1987. Samuel L. Jackson grew up in Chattanooga, Tennessee. His father lived away from the family in Kansas City, Missouri, and later died of alcoholism. Jackson met him only twice during his lifetime. Samuel L. Jackson was raised by his mother, who was a factory worker and later a supplies buyer for a mental institution. He was also raised by his maternal grandparents, Edgar and Pearl Montgomery, as well as extended family. Now, according to DNA tests, Samuel L. Jackson partially descends from the Benga people of Gabon, and he became a naturalized citizen of Gabon in 2019. He attended several segregated schools and graduated from Riverside High School in Chattanooga. Samuel L. Jackson played the French horn, piccolo, trumpet, and flute in the school orchestra. His stutter started during childhood. He learned to pretend to be other people who didn't stutter. He still uses the swearing word MF to get through a speech block and still has days where he stutters. Samuel L. Jackson's initial intent was to pursue a degree in marine biology, and that saw him attend Morehouse College in Atlanta, Georgia. But after joining a local acting group to earn extra points in a class, he found an interest in acting and switched his major. Before graduating in 1972, he co-founded the Just Us Theater. In 1969, Samuel L. Jackson and several other students held members of the Morehouse College Board of Trustees, including Martin Luther King Sr., hostage on the campus demanding reform in the school's curriculum and governance. The college eventually agreed to change its policy, but Jackson was charged with and eventually convicted of unlawful confinement. That was a second-degree felony. He was then suspended for two years for his criminal record and his actions. He would later return to the college and earn a B.A. in drama in 1972. While he was suspended, he took a job as a social worker in Los Angeles before he decided to return to Atlanta, where he met with Stokely Carmichael, H. Rapp Brown, and others active in the Black Power movement. He began to feel empowered with his involvement in the movement, especially when the group began buying guns. However, before he could become involved with any significant armed confrontations, his mother sent him to Los Angeles after the FBI warned her that he would die within a year if he remained with the group. In a 2018 interview with Vogue, he denied having been a member of the Black Panther Party. Samuel L. Jackson is 6 foot 2 inches tall or 1.89 meters tall. Samuel L. Jackson's Personal Life in 1980, Samuel L. Jackson married actress and producer LaTanya Richardson, whom he met while attending Morehouse College. The couple have a daughter named Zoe, who was born in 1982. In 2009, Samuel L. Jackson and his wife started their own charity to help support education. Samuel L. Jackson has said that he watches his own films in cinemas. Even during my theater years, I wished I could have watched the plays I was in while I was in them. I dig watching myself work. He also enjoys collecting the action figures of the characters he portrays in his films, including Jules Winfield, Shaft, Mace Windu, and Frozone. Samuel L. Jackson is bald but enjoys wearing wigs in his films. He said about his decision to shave his head, I keep ending up on those bald is beautiful lists. It's cool, you know? He's noted for often wearing a Kangol hat in public. Samuel L. Jackson has a clause in his contracts that allows him to play golf during film shoots. He's played in the Gary Player Invitational Charity Golf Tournament to assist Gary Player in raising funds for children in South Africa. 
Samuel L. Jackson is a keen basketball fan supporting the Toronto Raptors and the Harlem Globetrotters. He's also supported the English soccer team Liverpool Football Club since appearing in the 51st State film, which was shot in Liverpool. He also supports the Irish soccer team Bohemian Football Club. Samuel L. Jackson's Career Samuel L. Jackson rose to fame with films such as Coming to America in 1988, Goodfellas in 1990, Patriot Games in 1992, Juice in 1992, Menace to Society in 1993, Jurassic Park in 1993, and Fresh in 1994. Samuel Jackson's other roles include Die Hard with a Vengeance in 1995, A Time to Kill in 1996, Hard Eight in 1996, Ease by You in 1997, The Red Violin in 1998, The Negotiator in 1998, Unbreakable in 2000, Shaft in 2000 and its 2019 sequel reboot, Coach Carter in 2005, Snakes on a Plane in 2006, The Other Guys in 2010, Kong Skull Island in 2017, and Glass in 2019. Samuel L. Jackson also won widespread recognition as the Jedi Mace Windu in the Star Wars prequel trilogy from 1999 to 2005 and later voiced the role in the animated film Star Wars The Clone Wars in 2008. With his permission, his likeness was used for the ultimate version of the Marvel Comics character Nick Fury. He subsequently played Fury in 11 Marvel Cinematic Universe films beginning with a cameo appearance in Iron Man in 2008 as well as guest starring in the television series Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. He'll reprise this role in the upcoming Disney Plus series Secret Invasion, which is set to premiere in 2022. Samuel Jackson has provided his voice for several animated films, documentaries, television series, and video games, including Lucius Best as Frozone in the Pixar films The Incredibles in 2004 and Incredibles 2 in 2018, Whiplash and Turbo in 2013, the title character of the anime television series Afro Samurai in 2007, and Frank Tenpenny in the video game Grand Theft Auto San Andreas in 2004. Now, in 2021, it was announced by the Academy of Motion Pictures, Arts, and Sciences that Jackson will be the recipient of the Honorary Academy Award. Samuel L. Jackson's Real Estate In 2000, Samuel L. Jackson and his wife paid Roseanne Barr $8.4 million dollars for her 12,000-square-foot mansion in the private gated community of Beverly Park, which is located on top of a mountain in Beverly Hills. Today, this property is likely worth $20 to $30 million. In 2005, Samuel L. Jackson and his wife spent $4.9 million to acquire a multi-unit condo on the Upper East Side of Manhattan. They listed the house for sale in November 2018 for $13 million. Samuel L. Jackson's Car Collection Samuel L. Jackson owns or has owned a Toyota Camry, a Range Rover Sport, a Maybach 57S, a Rolls-Royce Phantom, and a Jaguar XF. Thanks for watching today. Let us know your favorite Samuel L. Jackson movie in the comments section. We'd really like to know. Give us a like, share, and subscribe to get more great content like this. Until next time.